Fuel pressure regulator. Purpose. The purpose of this pressure regulator is to keep track of the fuel pressure within the fuel rail. As the sensor detects this information, the data gets transmitted to the engine control unit and then the computer will analyze the data and make the necessary changes to the timing of the fuel injections and the quantity of the fuel being injected. Location This pressure regulator is located on the fuel rail and close to the intake manifold. Top 8 Symptoms of a Bad Fuel Pressure Regulator 1. Engine Misfires This is one of most common symptoms you will notice when your fuel pressure regulator is bad, is that your engine will misfire on idle or during acceleration. 2. Loss in acceleration An incorrect fuel pressure causes the air-fuel ratio in your car engine to be either too rich or too lean, and both of these mixture will cause a drop in acceleration. 3. Check engine light If one of these sensors fails, a trouble code will be stored in the engine control modules. And if this happens repeatedly, the check engine light will appear on your dashboard. 4. Fuel leakage Another common symptom when the fuel pressure regulator goes bad is fuel leakage, which causes performance problems and leads to bad smells. A fuel leak occurs when the fuel regulator diaphragm or outer seal is damaged and broken. 5. Black smoke from the exhaust pipe A bad fuel pressure regulator can cause a rich air-fuel mixture. This means that black smoke from the exhaust can be a sign of a bad fuel pressure regulator. 6. Spark plug covered with black debris When spark plugs are completely black and full of soot, it is a sign that your engine is running rich. It is also a sign that the fuel pressure regulator is bad and you may need to replace the fuel pressure regulator and the spark plugs. 7. Gasoline smell from the dipstick That's because an engine that runs rich for a long time will cause unburned fuel to flow into the oil pan and fill it with gasoline. 8. Drop in mileage A lean mixture will often cause your car to drop in acceleration as well, but you might only notice a drop in mileage.